1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verses 16 to 18. Always be joyful. Never stop praying. Be thankful in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you who belong to Christ Jesus. Do you belong to Christ Jesus? Are you truly a Christian? Do you call Jesus Abba, Father? Is he your Lord? Are you submitted to him? Well, if you are, this scripture is talking to you. Always be joyful. In the good times and in the bad times. In the times when you are feeling as if everything is going the way you want it to. And in the days when it seems like nothing is going the way you want it to. Always be joyful. Because you belong to him. And you know that all things are working together for your good. Whether it feels good or not. It is working for your good. So you can be joyful. You may not be feeling happy in the moment, but joy is more deep-seated than the feelings of happiness. So you can have joy even in the midst of tears. But most interestingly, I'd like to look at the instruction in verse 18. Be thankful in all circumstances. All circumstances. Like really? But don't you have some rather painful circumstances sometimes? Some annoying circumstances? Some disturbing circumstances. Yes, but we are told to be thankful in all of them. Why? For it is God's will for you. Now, that just got a little more confusing, don't you think? Can it really be God's will for me to have to put up with that person who just rubs me the wrong way every time? How can that be God's will for me? Doesn't God want me happy? Doesn't he want me to have peace? Why then it would be his will to have someone in my life who is consistently getting on my nerves, annoying me, causing me to feel so distressed. Well, have you ever noticed that the Lord has a way of using the opposites to bring out of us what he wants? And so he so often put in our lives the persons who will really cause us some distress in an effort to teach us and cultivate in us the things he wants in us. So he tells us that the trying of our faith works patience. So to get patience, he provides us with some trying times. He provides us with some things which frustrate us. To teach us how to love in the true meaning of the word, he blesses us with difficult people. 
Yes, it is the will of God concerning us because it's a part of the strategy to bring out of us, to cultivate in us his goodness, his grace, that we can bear fruits for his kingdom. So let's stop cursing the circumstances and start obeying the instruction. Be joyful, never stop praying, and be thankful in all circumstances. In due season, you will be everything God called you to be. God bless you. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And for more, join us at 9 a.m. at 10 Union Square, Crossroads, Kingston, Jamaica. If you can't be there in person, join us virtually via YouTube Live.